Jim Holly, Supercross Live on supercrossonline.com. Here with Kevin Windham, no stranger to winning and no stranger to winning in Quest Field. You won last year here. Uh, it's obviously going to be maybe not the same conditions as last year, but it's still going to be a little bit ruddy out there. Well, you never know here in, uh, in Seattle. It can be 20% chance of rain. Skies can open up. So uh, we're excited. We've had a lot of success here, even uh, going back to the real old days of the Kingdom and, uh, you know, last couple of years here. So uh, looking forward to a good night. Um, at this point, just kind of trying to be up in the front. You know, it's uh, still got a lot of craziness going on with the with the series, and uh, obviously one of our top guys that are out this weekend was Kennard, uh breaking his uh, his femur. And you know, who knows what can happen? I know there's a lot of excitement in the series right now, a lot of pressure on a lot of guys. And to be honest with you, I'm not one of them. So I just want to go out there and have a lot of fun and uh, hopefully find that podium. All right, all kidding aside, you're not in that championship hunt. But for Kevin Windham himself, who, who's won a couple of events last year, you've won throughout your professional career. Uh, you only got three more to go before, uh, you know, 2011 is over. How, how much pressure do you put on yourself to try to win one of these last three? Honestly, absolutely none at this point, which is probably, uh, you know, maybe a blessing, maybe a curse. I don't know, what, you know, where I stand and, and the reasons for it. I DNF three of the first seven rounds, took a lot of uh, a lot of wind out of the old sails on my way to what I felt was a, um, a potential win at Houston. You know, a lot of, a lot of my competitors had kind of given me the go ahead to win that thing. You know, it said, hey, we're not going to catch this guy tonight. And next thing you know, I knock myself out and I'm laying on the side of the ground. So we've, we've had some, uh, you know, some rough roads. And at this point in my career, it, it took a while to get back to where I was feeling like I could be fast enough to, to do some good. And, you know, it, it is the toughest series that it's ever been right now. The guys are going incredibly fast. And uh, reality is I haven't been one of them yet. So um, there's some things that I want to do in the off season um, to try to get there. And I still feel like we can we can hold our own in a couple of these races, but with three rounds to go, uh, it's not kind of the time to go on some you know new cr kind of crazy crusade to, to learn to, to save time. I want to work hard this off season, get some things set up. Going to be back with Geico next for, uh, next year for the uh, 2012 season. Uh, look forward to that, and uh, hopefully we can come back swinging. You know, this year did not go like we wanted to, and with three rounds to go, even though I've done really well here and, and think that I have a good chance of doing good still, it's not really the time to go. Uh, you know, kind of try to rebuild from the ground up. We're going to save that for 2012.